Stop, stop, stop. Don't throw away those things that you could be using again and again and again. We have so much stuff that we have in our homes that we tend to just throw away when, as an artist, you could be using that again and again and again. So before I throw anything away, I think, where can I use this? Where can I use it one more time before I throw it away? One more time. So I'm talking about things like lids. So, you know, you get the takeaway little containers and those lids are perfect, flat, great for things like little palettes. If you're going to just make a quick mixture of something, these little lids are perfect. I'm talking ice cream lids. I'm talking margarine tub lids. I'm talking about, you know, salad, takeaway salad uh, lids. I'm talking about meat um, uh, pl platter containers. So you give everything a really, really good wash and you can use it again. Um, more lids, um, meat container things, um, and this has got an amazing, amazing uh, pattern on it. I'm going to use that for stamping as well. It's so, that's so exciting. We have this treasure trove of stuff in our homes that as we're about to get rid of it, we could be thinking, where can I use it again? Another example, I've used like our water cleaner, uh, our window washer uh, water bottle as a spray bottle. Instead of going to buy one, I'm using that. Uh, old mayonnaise um, tubs I use as my rinsing uh, ones. They don't want to roll over and you can see what colors are in there. So, you know, you don't honestly need to go and buy things. Um, here's an example of a palette that I've been using. It's two lids that I've that sort of fit into together and I've taped it up with a bit of masking tape. And when you open it up, you have access to all your colors and they're soft and usable. And before I put them away again, I just give them a light spray, pop the lid back on top of each other like that. It actually seals. And then close it up with a masking tape just to be sure that it stays nice and sealed. So next time I need those colors, I've got them ready to go. It's like having a wet palette. I mean, a wet palette, to have a wet palette, that is possible. And I can talk you guys through that. I'll do another video about a wet palette. But this is so useful. Even like old... Um, uh, laminated sheets that I like I do a lot of uh, kids holiday classes and stuff and once you know that laminated sheet has done its thing I mean it's got dates on um, I've got to get rid of it but I often use this to mix paints and you can actually see there I've actually used it to uh, protect pages in between uh, in a book when I'm busy doing art um, lessons I put this in between the pages so that the pages if I go a bit too wide with my paints it doesn't actually make the pages stick together. So there's so many ways you can use um, those things that you've got in your home. Think before you throw away. Can I use it one more time? And then even this, as I'm looking at that, instead of washing it out and it's wasting water, I'm going to keep on using it as much as I can and then um, give it a toss once I'm ready. All right, guys, thank you for being here. All the best. It's Sonia Farrell from All Heart by Sonia Farrell. Um, I love to inspire you, help you get creative, um, help to uh, create, uh, to develop your own creative voice. Thanks for being here. Keep well. Bye.